Good morning, my lovers. Oh, I'm back out. It's a lovely day today. Cool breeze. Th there's a bit of a threat of a maybe a shower, but I got me brolly and me waterproofs. So I'll be all right. Right, I got a signal. Should we have a look? Look at this, my lovers. It's a fruit tree that's gone over. And uh, obviously somebody was leaning up against the tree after picking fruit, I suppose, leaned back and out it popped. And it just popped out over there, my lovers. I'll go and grab it. You can see what's been in this field, can't you? Right, where's it to? Oh, here it is. Now, is that a coin or a button? It's looking a bit crusty. Looking very crusty. Looks a little bit Roman. I'm going to have to clean it up and get back to you. Right now, my lovers, that's a bit of a quandary, isn't it? What's a Roman coin doing right up against the tree stump? Maybe someone found it, put it in their pocket, and then dropped it again. Because it is, my lovers. I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure this is a Roman coin. You can just see his nose there, looking to the right. It's a bit crusty, but it looks pretty Roman to me. See how it odd shape looks, see how the, the edges are all like rounded over. On the back, I can't see much at all, it needs a bit of a clean, a bit of a soak in some olive oil, me thinks. Right, got a bit, there's a bit of dirt there, look. Right, so yes, a Roman coin. Oh, is that right? Can't see it myself now. Where's it gone? Ah, there it is. Right, woohoo! Second signal, Roman coin. Lovely jubbly. Do a bit more searching around here. That, where that tree might have gone over, it might have pushed it up from deeper down, look. Right, on to the next. You can join my Patreon page for as little as a dollar. That's 81 pence in pound sterling. Probably another spendable. Modern money, I should be finding loads of modern money here for some bizarre reason. Oh, let's crack it open, get more vigorous with it. Oh, what's that? Don't look promising. Thought I saw a bit of foil then. Did I see a bit of foil? Ah, no, I didn't see a bit of foil, I saw something else. <gasps> it's not. I think it is, my lovers. I think I found one. A silver thimble. I think I got a silver thimble. I've never found one. Yes, my lovers. Woohoo! A silver thimble. Look at that. Lovely jubbly. Funny design. Got any all marks? Ah, we might have. What's that there? Was that just a dent? Nope, silver thimble. That's made my day, that has. Three years I've been looking for a silver thimble. And I've just found a right flat one. <laughs> right. Woohoo! Silver! Right. Oh, oh, that's it, me lovers. It's a stone, but no ordinary stone. This, my lovers, looks like a whetstone. See how it curves in? Someone. A long, long time ago, 
was using this stone to sharpen their knives. Uh, unfortunately it's broken, but I'm pretty sure that's a whetstone. Let's see if we can clean, I'll clean it up a bit, see if there's any markings or anything on there, but I think it's just a whetstone. Oh, there we go my lovers, one whetstone. So it curves in, where well, the knife has been pressed down. Yeah, definitely curving in. Right, there you go, back in the day they would use one of these to sharpen their knives. Not on the end. Right, on to the next. Ooh. I think I got some silver! Oh yeah, looks like silver my lovers. Ooh, ooh. Very small coin. Now I have had a few foreign coins from this bit of the field recently. Well not recently, but I have had some. Um, I don't know why. Get a load of foreign coins here. Uh, does that say Netherlander? No. Looks foreign. Oh look, it's got um, mountain points on the coin. Look, someone's mounted it up. It's got little things. Perhaps it's a rare coin. It says 10 cents 1937. Let's get some better light on it. That's what you get for putting a smaller coil on. Right, I don't know what country this one's from, my lovers, but it definitely looks foreign. It looks like Neverlanden. That's in that, um, uh, the Netherlands. Right. We'll have to see if we can find out what this one coin is. I'll get Daryl to look it up on his phone. He's got one of these modern confounded phone things. You can search things out. Right. Here you go, my lovers. It looks like there, these, these things have been soldered on. And it looks like they've got a bit of solder over the edge of the coin there. So we've got a soldering iron at home. I'll whack it on there and see if they come off. Right. Let's join it over. There she blows. Ooh, got my thumb print on there. Yeah. Bizarre. Now, that's two coins like that I found here. And an American coin. Weird how things go on in the fields, isn't it? Right, on to the next. That's a bit weird, my lovers. I was just about to fill the hole back in, and I put the coil back over the hole to see, uh, just to make sure there was nothing else there, and... There's another coin in there, I think. Ooh, another big silver, that would be lovely. And it's in the same place as the other silver coin. Ooh, perhaps it's a big gold coin. Let's go a bit further back. Oh, 
there's another one. There's another one. An identical, is it identical? It's the same coin. And that's got these mountain points as well. Oh, did I nick that one? No. That's an old nick. That's all right. Thought it was me. No, it's an old nick. Let's get some better light on it. Yeah, it's an old nick. 1938, this one. That's a bit weird, isn't it? What's the chances of that? Double silver. Woohoo! Must have been off a bracelet or something. I'm going to have to check round here to see if there's any more signals. Weird. Right. How bizarre. On to the next. Oh, look at what I found down here, my lovers. What's that then? Is it a whacking good big diamond? Look at the size of it. Must be at least four carats. It's a bit weird, isn't it? It might be silver. I think it might be silver, my lovers. I don't know what it is. It looks a bit weird, but it looks silverish. I thought it was going to be a bit of fake jewellery or something, but it looks like it's silver. Right, I'll get it cleaned up and I'll get it back to you. Oh, cool, there it is, my lovers. Yeah, I think it's silver. It looks like silver, so hopefully that is a huge great big stone and I've just found something worth thousands of pounds because look at the size of it, it's monstrous. Lovely jubbly. Mm. Right. On to the next. Blows the wind on my true love and gently drops the rain. I have never had but one true love in Greenwood, he lies slain. 